Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Megan with Simply Megan Plans. And this video, I am going to be decorating my currently page, my first, first, first one in my brand new 2022 Happy Planner. This is a classic size. And let me show you what exactly the currently page is. So it is right on where the tab is. This is the January divider. The currently page is the page right beside it. And us in the planner community, we kind of just like call it that because originally on the happy planners, it used to say currently and it would have like all the different things that you can fill in that you're currently doing, like currently reading, what you're currently loving, what you're currently eating, what you're currently drinking, like stuff that you really are doing often in January. So that's why we call it that. But now the Happy Planner is really going more towards neutral. So keeping things super, super plain, which has evolved into that. It slowly um, got more and more neutral. And now this is mostly what all the planners are looking like. And I have to be honest, I am loving it. I am super, super excited. I love these three areas. I think that's really cool. I love that this is a dot grid. It's just, it's fun. So the only thing I'm not loving is this divider for January. It's just not wintry at all. This is like a bright yellow. So I don't know, I'm gonna make it work. So I'm gonna be using Good Vibes because it has this exact yellow in it and Let's get started. So what I was thinking is there is a strip. Back here. And I was going to do this one. Never give up on your dreams. These little pieces that I'm not completely using, I'm just going to stick back in the book for possible later use. But I want to make this area down here to be a currently like area. Okay, so that's where I'm starting. And at the end, I will punch this so this piece won't be overlapped. Okay, I have some currently words. Then this colorful boxes. I'm gonna see. I guess I could do gold. And do that. I'll do currently feeling. This is probably all going to be about moving. Feeling overwhelmed because we're packing. Um, watching, let's do that. Uh, drinking, I like to do. Um, planning and maybe something else. So I'm gonna leave it five just for now. So that was out of the original colorful boxes. And let's see how I wanna decorate it. So the reason I wanted to use the gold was because of this page. I like this hello, it's super cute. I definitely need to bring some yellow over here because of the divider. So let's look out for what I wanna do there. Um, 
Oh, also the bullet points. So I think I am going to do like important dates because we're moving and stuff. I need to put like last day for power, you know, when to cut off our security system, stuff like that. So I'm going to leave actually this part open, but this part priorities and goals, that's going to be like a really good checklist. So I'm going to use these stars. We'll do pink and yellow because of the divider. So I, I really, really like to make sure that the pages feel like they go together. So just meet three main priorities and goals for the month. And then up here, I can do like, Let's see what yellow stuff I want to get. Really like this. This pink and yellow, and it says good vibes. I'll probably put that down there, but let me flip through to make sure though. Definitely could use a box. So let me put that up there. decide. I think I would like to do this dream big, maybe layer with this. Let me pull that out. So this is a student book, so it has a lot of school stuff, but you can always just like cut the labels off and make it your own label or white it out or layer it to overlap that part so it doesn't show. I could label this to be January, but it says it January up there, so I think that's okay. The other option is to maybe decorate this page a little bit around the big star. Maybe you want to do a hang loose thing right here. Okay, and then Probably wouldn't hurt to do one of these guys. This is this might be for you know, like when you're moving, there's just a lot that you need to like keep track of and everything. So this might be something that I need to, I have like a due date that I need to make sure and make some notes, stuff like that. So I'm just thinking ahead um, that I know I'll have something where I need to write things down. So I'm keeping that area open. Okay, now let me fill these in. Feeling this, let's do this. If I don't have room for loving, I can put it under. So I think it's pretty heavy on the pink, to be honest. Let's get some navy in here. Um, 
So this will be the label for whatever it's gonna be. This is like very functional, I like it. So these stars, I think I wanna put a little bit on this, I don't know, should I? Just a little bit, just a little bit. I don't know, <laughs> I might change that, who knows? But let's see, let's see what we think. Oh, I need to punch this. think it is all done. This is very like unexpected for a January divider for me because <laughs> normally it would be like wintry and stuff like that but I actually really really like that the divider forced me to do something different because it's a new year so I should try new things you know. Okay, let me know what you guys think. Do you like it? Do you not? Um, you know, I'm kind of on the fence. I don't hate it. I always just sit here and stare at it after I'm all done. <laughs> okay, um, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I absolutely love to hear from you in the comments. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.